2022 is the bicentennial year of Ulysses S. Grant's birth. This is a series of vignettes that lift up the people, events, or moments of note in Grant's life as seen through his eyes. These are rich glimpses that give insight into Ulysses S. Grant's life and who or what impacted him to mold the leader he became. This series is available on the Facebook page Ulysses S. Grant Bicentennial Moments and the YouTube channel General Grant by himself. April 7th, 1862. I'm Major General Ulysses S. Grant on the second day of the Battle of Shiloh or Pittsburgh Landing. It is April the 7th of 1862. <clears throat> I wrote this message, sent this telegram to General Halleck regarding the battle being fought near Pittsburgh Landing or Shiloh, Tennessee. To Major General Halleck, yesterday the rebels attacked us here with an overwhelming force, driving our troops in from their advanced position nearer to the landing. General Wallace was immediately ordered up from Crump's Landing, and in the evening, one division of Buell's army and D.C. Buell in person arrived. During the night, one other division arrived, and still another today. This morning at the break of day, I ordered an attack which resulted in a fight that continued until late this afternoon, with a very heavy loss on both sides but a complete repulse of the enemy. I shall follow tomorrow far enough to see that no immediate renewal of attack is contemplated. U.S. Grant. I also sent this message to General D.C. Buell. Major General D.C. Buell, General. When I left the field this evening, my intention was to occupy the most advanced position possible for the night with the infantry engaged through the day and follow up our success with cavalry and fresh troops expected to arrive during my last absence on the field. The great fatigue of our men, they having been engaged in two days fight and subject to a march yesterday and fight today, would preclude the idea of making any advance tonight without the arrival of the expected reinforcements. My plan, therefore, will be to feel on in the morning with all the troops on the outer lines until our cavalry force can be organized, one regiment of your army will finish crossing soon, and a sufficient artillery and infantry support to follow them ready for a move. Under the instructions which I had previously received and a dispatch also today from Major General Halleck, it will not then do to advance beyond P Ridge or some point which we can reach and return in a day. General Halleck will probably be here himself tomorrow. Instructions have been sent to the different division commanders not included in your command to be ready in the morning either to find if an enemy was in front or to advance. Very respectfully, your obedient servant, U.S. Grant, Major General commanding. I am Major General Ulysses S. Grant at Pittsburgh Landing on the Tennessee River in Tennessee, second day of the Battle of Pittsburgh Landing. It is April the 7th, 1862. This has been a Ulysses S. Grant Bicentennial Moment.